In an executive order, Governor Gavin Newsom ordered California officials to start addressing homeless encampments throughout the state. I'm Priscilla Lara, your neighborhood reporter. The order was placed Thursday morning following the Supreme Court's decision in Grant Pass to address dangerous homeless camps. According to a release, Newsom has invested billions across state agencies and departments to address the housing crisis, a crisis that is easily seen in Kern County. Kern County's 2024 point-in-time count revealed a 37% increase in the homeless population from the previous year. In 2024, a total of 2,669 individuals were reported to be experiencing homelessness, with more than half being unsheltered. Per the order, encampments can be removed if they pose a threat to the life, health, and safety of the individual and that threat in the safety and viability of nearby businesses and neighborhoods, such as an encampment along waterways. Before removing the camps, the order requires a few things, including a notice to vacate the area at least 48 hours before commencing the removal, and those agencies are also required to collect, label, and store personal belongings for at least 60 days. While this order is asking for the state and local governments to do more, Newsom encourages local governments to apply for the newly available funding from Proposition 1. In response to Newsom's order, Kern County Chief Operations Officer Stacy Kuwahara says in part, quote, the County of Kern partners and utilizes all available resources to meet the needs of our community. We have a special ordinance to address homeless encampments and respond quickly. We are removing encampments in our county right-of-ways in county parks and in Kern's unincorporated areas. We are currently reviewing the governor's executive order order to address homeless encampments and look forward to future funding opportunities to continue to enhance the services offered. In another statement, the city of Bakersfield said in part, quote, the city supports the emphasis on this issue and looks forward to collaborating with state agencies as they address encampments in their areas of responsibility. The city adds the order will not bring any noticeable changes to Bakersfield as practices consistent with the state's policies are already in place. Over the past four years, the city says they've been able to create outreach teams and programs to move people off the streets. They say a challenge they face is a lack of accountability in the criminal justice and mental health systems, saying, quote, Our community still needs jail beds, detox and sober living beds to divert individuals from jail, residential beds for those with behavioral health needs, and more permanent supportive housing. 23ABC reached out to KCSO and BPD but have not heard back. Kern BHRS preferred not to comment. The California Interagency Council of Homelessness will provide guidance and assistance so that local agencies and homelessness programs can comply with the order. For 23ABC, I'm your neighborhood reporter, Priscilla Lara.